Today I wanted to show you how to use a great tool Eclipse has called the Dictionary Builder. You will need to have a file uh, that's a TXT file with a list of words or phrases. And then you will just go to Eclipse. You need to open up a dictionary. Now you can open up your main dictionary or you can open up a uh, job dictionary or just one that you create. I have created this one called testing and I'm going to use this to build some phrase words. Then you would click on tools and build dictionary. Now the dictionary builder comes with a number of uh, 2,000 I think words that you already built in that you can just start building if you would like. Uh, it gives you some choices here. If you'd like any of this steno, you could just click on it and it would add it. Uh, you can also enter things manually. This brings up the, the steno keyboard emulator and you can add them in. But right now I have my machine connected. Now one other little setup I have done is I have chosen RBGS to be my stroke to tell it, okay, I like the stroke I made and go ahead and put it in the dictionary. The STPH means go back to a previous word. And then the FPLT for me means go ahead to the next one. And I use the asterisk to delete if I stroke something that I don't like. And you can change these by clicking on them and just choosing them. So now I have my dictionary builder open and I am going to look for that list of phrases that I want to enter here. I have put them on my desktop and they are right here. So now Eclipse Dictionary Builder is just going to give me those phrases that I have in that text file. So question I see, I'm going to write it. Do I like this demo? Yes, I do. So I'm going to hit the RBGS to say yes. Question OK. All right, I like that one. Question uh-huh. And you see how it's building it in the dictionary that I have placed here. So question all right. Oops, I didn't like that stroke, so I hit the asterisk. And I will do my question all right. And then here I'm going to go back. I'm going to say, oh, I want to go back and do another one again. Maybe you can put multiple strokes in if you want. So when you are done, you have this beautiful dictionary full of the words and it's taking you a fraction of the time it would to uh, do it another way. And then you can just either merge it into your main dictionary if you like or keep it as a job dictionary.